I am Dr. Jayant Sampath. I am the Senior Consultant Pediatric Orthopedic Surgeon at Rainbow Children's Hospital, Marathalli, Bangalore. We have a well-developed uh, Pediatric Orthopedic Department consisting of myself and my colleague, Dr. Girish Kumar, who is also a, a full-time fellowship-trained Pediatric Orthopedic Surgeon. Cerebral palsy, uh, it's also called CP uh, for short, uh, is another common um, physical disability that affects children. It typically happens when a child is born prematurely, when the birth weight is less than 1.5 kilograms, um, and the child has been admitted to NICU due to low birth weight. It can also happen when there are problems during birth and there is a reduction in blood supply or oxygen supply to the brain. There are various other genetic uh, and uh, other causes of clubfoot, but premature baby or birth asphyxia are the two main uh, causes that happen uh, in the modern world. Cerebral palsy has to be diagnosed correctly for which uh, a pediatric neurologist or a developmental pediatrician uh, typically uh, plays an important role. Uh, at Rainbow Children's Hospital in Bangalore, we have a very good team of pediatric neurologists and developmental pediatricians who are able to diagnose the problem accurately and they are, uh, they are responsible for the medical management uh, by giving uh, medicines to reduce tightness in the muscles. Um, we also uh, start orthopedic treatment quite early. Um, in the Up to the age of six years, orthopedic treatment mainly consists of physiotherapy, uh, applying uh, splints or um, specialized braces to the legs. And we also uh, advise the parents to do regular exercises at home. In certain children who have excessive spasticity or muscle tightness, who are younger than six years, we use uh, treatments such as botulinum injection into the muscles. This helps to reduce the tightness in the muscle. Surgery for cerebral palsy should typically be done only after the age of six or seven years once the child's gait is matured. Prior to any gait improvement surgery, orthopedic surgery, it is essential to perform a test called a 3D gait analysis. This uses computerized software and 3D uh, movement tracking technology to correctly analyze the exact nature of the walking problem in the child. Previously, orthopedic surgery used to be done purely on the basis of physical examination or through visual observation of gait. The human eye is incapable of capturing the finer details of gait, which is why we use a 3D gait analysis lab. The exact surgical treatment plan is based on the 3D gait analysis and following the surgery, it is important to uh, perform intensive physiotherapy for up to 12 months after the intervention. So uh, with a scientific and rational treatment approach, it is possible to improve the walking of most children who are born with uh, cerebral palsy and at Rainbow Children's Hospital, we are proud to inform you that we have all the specialized technology, facilities and the expertise in order to be able to treat uh, children with cerebral palsy in the best possible way. Thank you.